Hey everyone, welcome back. We got $70 in tickets here. Uh, I really wanted to play the Cash Royale ticket from uh, that came out last year, but it's been kind of hard to find. So we got tickets 13 through 15 for 100X and a random ticket 24 for Jumbo Cash. We need the stack of coins or gold bar or a treasure chest to win 50, 100, or 200, or else we need to match with a jumbo symbol to win automatically. Odds on these are winning 3.43. Let's lock in the focus and get this purple people eater scratched off. All right. You know what, I'm gonna save myself the <laughs> trouble of symbol hunting because, they oh, look at that. All right, we got a match right out the gate. Oh, we got two matches and we haven't even done the rest of the ticket. Let's keep going. 57, we have that. 20, 34, 55, 56, we have 36, 41, single one, 59, we have that, 5, this could very well be 50 the hard way, 53, 3, 4, a 50, and 51. Okay, so we had a lot going on, but I think this is going to be 10 in each spot. 258 57 and I think the other one was oh crap 59 so 50 bucks that is the easy win to find in Maryland but we'll take it all right so we just need to win on one of these and we can say we got all our money back so all right we need a match to the winning numbers on this one uh or else one of the multipliers on this uh odds on these tickets are one in 3.03 .03. I just remembered I wanted to double check this other one to make sure that this is this stands. All right, it is definitely 50. Okay. All right, we're good. Okay, let's uh get our numbers out and see what we have. All right, we got 16, 18, 7, 43, and 60. 16, 18, 7, 43, and 60. Just keep loading me up with 50s. Oh, we got 18. So we're getting uh, all our money back for this session. At least 22, 36, 11, 56. I wasn't sure if I was going to play this one because there was a couple in front of me and they were buying like random tickets and I couldn't see everything they were getting. But I think the, the wife got one of these last and I was like, uh, all right, let me just try one. <laughs> so maybe I'll get the, the winner. All right. Four last row, 39, 30. We have 60, 54 and 17. Our match was on the trap and we got 20 bucks. So we are at a break even. It's not Often these uh, twenty dollar tickets have multiple matches. All right, we got ticket number fourteen. Ticket fourteen. Ah, so I could rake that across, but the foil is saying no. Thirty eight, thirty six, four twenty one, or thirty two. Oh, I thought I had it. <laughs> I knew I said something with a one. Fifty one, six, fifty six, fifty. We have no fifties. I've only ever found a multiplier on this ticket once. So they are definitely not very common because the fact that uh, a 5X will give you at least 100 bucks and $100 is not a easy win to find, believe it or not. So 25, 23, we have 32, 33. Still nothing. Last row, 34, 260. Oh my God. <laughs> I just talked it up. And this is what I get for not symbol hunting because I would have never expected to get that. But I'm pretty sure it's going to be $100. All right, we'll take that $100. So we are now in a profit. And since I know that it is possible to get. All right, it is definitely 100 Okay. Well, nice. We've won on almost every ticket. Let's see if we can win on this last one. I'm not even going to symbol hunt because 
chances of finding another multiplier in the same pack are probably one in one billion. 11, 430, 16, 29. 11, 430, 16, or 29. Right, nothing so far. 42. We have no 40s up there. No 50s. 14. We have four. Eight. All right, last row. Let's see. We can go straight. 38, 58, and 27. All right, I don't think we have anything there. All right, let's see. No win on that one. All right, well, we got 170 back on a $70 purchase. Just tune in, stay tuned. I'm going to show you guys some of the stats from uh, the last quarter of 2024 of how I did with the channel. Um, so stick around for that. I'll be right back. All right, guys, so in my effort to be transparent, this is the breakout of the quarter, second quarter of 2024 of what I spent to run the channel. Uh, as you can kind of see, the total play started to go down each month <laughs> because ad revenue was kind of terrible. Um, but I basically was playing within my budget. And let's see, overall, it looks like I was getting back about 70%, like 75% probably between all three months. Um, and the cost of the channel started to go down because I started trying to run some smaller sessions uh, for each uh, month. So yeah, that's the breakout. But let's take a look at month to month and get a little bit closer look at that. Let's take a look at the month, the monthly breakout. So for April, uh, looks like I spent a total of about $6,000 and had about $5,000 in winnings uh, for an overall return of about 79%. Um, I just started breaking out the states. So I really don't count this line with the Maryland and PA totals because I only captured it for maybe one third of the month. But um, overall, I mean, I had a couple of bright spots that 157% uh, win right here. Um, that was a good one. I had this one right here. So there, there were a couple of little blips right there, but the largest one was probably here. I forget what this was because um, that was a couple months ago. But yeah, April was eh, okay. May was a little bit more mature. I did have um, better tracking by state. So it looks like Maryland, I played about 2,800 and a little bit less in PA. Um, overall, it looks like Maryland did much better in, in May <laughs> than PA, um, almost 50% better. Uh, the breakout pretty much kind of looks like this. I believe in... May, I started working on the tournament of 10s. So a lot of the $100 entries you see for Maryland towards the end are probably that. Um, but yeah, I mean, a couple of bright spots. That 500 was probably, um, I forget what that was. <laughs> like, I forget. But there were a couple of bright spots in, in May. Um, let's go jump to June. June was not so friendly. June was kind of awful, um, and I played a little bit less, as you can kind of see. Uh, you guys saw that in the summary. Um, my ad revenue has been like kind of in the toilet because that's what happens with YouTube. So this is pretty much what we're looking at. 3,600 played, 2,600 in winning, 71% overall return, and they were pretty close. I mean, Mar Pennsylvania had a slight edge in terms of the re return percentage. Um, at 77 versus 66 and as you can see there were quite a few losses I mean that's the that's the thing all the time anyway so you know it is what it is but there were not a lot of great sessions uh, to be had at all if you look at it by date so these are not necessarily indicative of the dates of when you see the videos, but this is just kind of me tracking like over time. So just wanted to give you guys a little bit behind the scenes of what it looks like to run a channel. Because, you know, again, if I wasn't getting paid through YouTube, I would not be <laughs> playing as much as I do. Um, but yeah, that's kind of what it looks like. So play responsibly, guys, and I'll catch you on the next one.